Hey guys, Rick Personas here, back to our video. So in this video, we're gonna make an underground tech house drop like the upcoming artist, Sasa UK, like he did in songs as these. Oh. So it's a really underground tech house kind of style, so let's straight dive into it. Let's start off with a vocal, then work on the minimal drums, minimal bass, and some other bass elements. So to start it off, I picked a vocal from the new underground tech house pack. It's packed with a lot of vocals, drums, presets, all the stuff you need to make this kind of style of music. So the vocal sounds like this. I'm lost, my friend is gone, but the phone don't stop, let's fuck Miami up. So we'll be using this in the build up and then drop it around here. So I cut up the vocal just a little bit more to, to let it fit in the drop. Every four bars it repeats. I'm lost. Let's fuck Miami up. I'm lost. Let's fuck Miami up. Just like this. So that will be our starting point of the track. Now we're gonna build a groovy drums. So let's open up the underground tagas back and pick some drums from it. First we're gonna start off with the core drum loops. We'll be using this kick. And then we're gonna use this drum loop together sounding like this it's a great starting point for a minimal groove so now we're gonna pick a glitchy loop from the pack these days a lot of underground tech house tunes use those glitchy loops in there so we got a lot of those loops in the pack so we'll be using this one just drop it in sounding like this Already add some more bounce to it, which is dope, but we're gonna add some more to it. So now we're gonna add a closed head to it. So we'll be using this sound. Open up the piano roll. Then we're gonna quantize it to add some more groove to it to get it off the grid, as you can see. And then just mess around a little bit with the velocity as well to humanize it. Just like this. So together the drums will sound like this. So now we're gonna add the transient shaper to the drum bus. We'll be using this plugin, it's a free plugin, so make sure to check it out. Just boosting a little bit. Sounding like this. So then I add some more loops to the second part of the drop. With this right loop. This chance. Crash, downlifter, uplifter, a snare roll. So all together the drums sound like this. So now we're gonna dive in the bass line. It's gonna be quite a minimal punchy bass. So let's pick a preset from the pack. I got this new serum loaded up. We'll be using this Sasa UK kind of inspired preset. Sounding like this. So first let's make the MIDI. We're gonna start off on the C sharp. Just like this. Then just tweak the velocity. Let's bring it down a bit. And we're gonna add some more emphasis on this note. So this will be the main riff. It sounds quite weird right now, but together with the kick and drums, it will sound quite dope. So let's duplicate this and make a little variation. Just change the groove a little bit. Then duplicate it again. And tweak it just a little bit more. Again, to add some more variation. So now we're gonna mix it. It's gonna be fairly simple mixing. Just a big side chain to make room for the kick. And the R bass to bring out the sub a little bit more. So that's it for the bass. Together with the kick, it sounds like this. So we got a foundation of the track ready. We got a bass and drums. So now we're gonna spice it up some more with some leads and bass steps. So first of all, I got this new serum to it. Let's add a preset from the pack. First, let's use this reverse bass. And place it at C sharp to fit it to fit the key of the track. 
sounded like this. It's quite weird, but now we're gonna mix it. First, got rid of the low end because we have the bass playing already. Then open up the stereo field. Add some OTT compression. Then the reverb. And delay to push it back in the mix. And then make sure to get rid of the low end again. And of course add a sidechain to it. So that will be the first step. Now we're gonna add a second one to it. So let's duplicate the serum. You can hear it got the same mixing as the previous step. Let's pick a preset from the pack again. We'll be using this saw step. And just place it right here. Sounding like this. In context with the bass, it will sound quite dope, so... Now we're gonna add a second one to it. Again, duplicate the serum. So we got the same mixing. Then we're gonna pick this dunk preset. Quite a dope sound. So we want to have this at the end of the bar. And then we're gonna select the triplet rhythm. Just like this. Just to break the groove a little bit. So that's it for the bass and lead steps. I think they're quite dope. They really, they really make the track a bit more unique. So together with a kick and bass, it sounds like this. So we got all the elements ready with the bass, drums, leads and vocals. So now we're gonna quickly arrange it, make a little build up with it. So, so I just made a quick build up. I added some ambient sounds to it. And I copied over some elements from the drop. With a kick roll as well to it. And I added some automations on the master channel to get rid of the low ends in the build up. And of course, add a smell to it. So that's it for the Sasa UK kind of style drop. I think it turned out really dope. So, so if you like the video, please drop a like, leave a comment, hit the subscribe button. And I see y'all in the next videos. Don't stop it, fuck why you me up